M0FXB, welcome back to my learning video on the FX4CRHF 6 meter transceiver. This is the new model with the USB C on the side. You just see it here, and we've also got the round DC input, so it's the new model, and a built in fan here. So this one did come from AliExpress. If you go to the BG2FX site, you'll see that it's out of stock. But there are plenty on AliExpress, so get them while you can, because I can't see anything wrong with mine. Now, remember, they are this green color. I know that the, the, on the left there, they look black, but they're green. You might find a black one, but the one I've got is like a greeny color. So this today is about the FT8 settings. On the left here, we've got the settings that are, you know, are described in detail. So you can see there, you select your COM port. So mine is connected. If I right click device manager, double click my ports, there it is there. Now, I have been trying to install the silicon driver, so this might be my problem. There's a link for the silicon driver just here, and I'll put it in the description, CP210. So what I'm gonna try and do is uninstall and reinstall, but I thought I'd show you the settings. The other thing to uh, check is when you do go device manager and go to ports, just make sure, wrong one, right click properties, just make sure you're on 115200, okay, so just get that in there. So my COM port number is 24, but on here it's 3, so you put your COM port here, COM3, COM3, you select Kenwood TS590 in the radio tab and uh, the only thing that I saw that was changed was on the just here it says RTS you select that and down below you select USB and then none and then your cat should go green now mine isn't going green but it could be because of my driver I'll just show you just retry we're going to go file settings of course you get your call sign in there M0FXB, IO81, I didn't change anything else. Radio, 590, I've got my COM24, the, the cable is connected. I've got 115200, COM24, USB. So I've, I've pretty much got all the settings in there that are required. But when I go test cat, I am getting some brief PTT, I'm um, some flickering, but I'm getting these errors here. So I'm gonna keep trying with the, with changing the driver. Um, and audio wise you can see that that is coming up micro microphone USB PNP sound device okay so that's all seems to be working fine didn't change anything else at the moment I've got a signal here although I'm not receiving any FTA I'm in digital mode now the way you do digital mode on this device is if you look if you tap the SSB just tap the SSB just here it changes to LSB, but if you tap it again, the word digital appears at the top. Now, if I leave it where we can hear it, that's the digital not selected. So as soon as you select digital, it, it mutes it. And test cat. There, I'll rig fail. Even if I unplug the cable and plug it back in. So I, I'm not going to give up. I'll get it in the end. I just got this feeling it could be my... But once you've got it, it seems to me like you do get rig control. You know, I mean frequency control. Audio, and you can set your audio. There are settings that's recommended here. I'll put the link in the description. Hopefully that hasn't muted my audio uh, on the video. But down here, all the settings there are described in detail. And the main one they say is leave ALC to zero. That's the main one, volume about 50%. I'll put the link in. Thanks for watching my YouTube channel, bye for now.